everyone. Good morning. It's now day, is it day six? Day six. Day six for us. So um, we got woken up by the alarm clock in our room going off. I don't know who set that, but <laughs> it was at six o'clock. So quick, you don't ever just uh, wake me up. Oh, I, just, like, I, I jumped out. <coughs> oh, so we know who done it. Oh, Paige. So six o'clock, the alarm started going off. Then Charlie come over, whispered in my ear that the change of plan for today, <laughs> which I'm so excited about. Um, so the plan is we're going to Animal Kingdom this morning. We're going to have some lunch there. We're then going to make a move from there. We're going to go bath and body work because Charlie's got an nine. email with all discounts and all Nine's that sort of stuff. Nine. What's on offer today? Uh, all the body care is $5.95. All the body care is $5.95. And when it's that price, you can't miss it. Um, and then we're going to have dinner somewhere. I think we're going to go out back steakhouse. Yeah, then we're going to go to Magic Kingdom. So um, the whole day just making we're going to have a busy day. So it's <laughs> the return of Happily Ever After tonight um, for the fireworks show. So. We're gonna be there tonight. We'll be recording it and showing you guys it. I will try and um, record it and then put it out onto YouTube um, tonight probably. But um, we've just got some Starbucks. Paige has got a um, vanilla bean. Vanilla bean. Vanilla bean. Vanilla bean. Frappuccino, I think. Frappuccino. And Charlie's got a hot cappuccino. So me and Teddy got nothing. Teddy, mummy got a drink. Paige got a drink. Teddy got nothing. He got nothing. So, uh, yeah, we're just about to get in the car and make our way over to Animal Kingdom. In the first stop is going to be the safari ride. I want to try and get that done and out of the way because that queue does get crazy. So, we will see you at Animal Kingdom. Right, so we've just got to Animal Kingdom and we had the first. Our first ever time. We didn't have to pay for parking. We drove up to the window and the man was like, yep, go through. We're a bit annoyed though, because we got Magic Kingdom later, just to watch the fireworks. And now we've got to pay $25 to just go and do that. So if we was only doing Animal Kingdom today, we'd have saved ourselves $25. And by the way, it's so busy here. Oh, it's like, absolutely round. We'll show you. Okay, so this is us walking to the Animal Kingdom gate. We had to wait in traffic for about 10 minutes. So I think we'll be here for an hour and then we'll be coming out. We're fully against buying Genie Plus. It in May, yeah, because it was cheaper in May. It was only $15. Yeah. So the At the moment, it's $29 per person. So that's $90 near enough for me, Paige, and Teddy. Me, Paige, and Charlie. And then you have to pay more if you want to go on the, the bigger rides. But in May, you pay $15 and then you just paid extra if you wanted to get on the bigger rides. Yeah, yeah, it was horrible. So we're, we're against that idea. We're not going to be doing that. Um, I don't want to be giving Disney any more money than what they get already from us. So, um, yeah, this is our current situation. So we will see you inside of the park. Okay, so we've just got through into Animal Kingdom. It's 10 past nine now. So in total, that probably took us about 40 minutes, 50 minutes from outside the car park to inside. Um, it's very, very busy here. Charlie had to wait in the queue for about 10, 15 minutes in the pram line. She had no bags, she just had the pram. But I think we're gonna go to, yeah, Everest first. We was gonna go and do safari, but that's 70 minutes. So yeah, we're gonna go over to um, Everest and we'll see you guys there. Okay, so me and Teddy are just queuing up for the dinosaur ride. You tired? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so this is the ride just here. Teddy wants to get in the camera again. Are you excited? Yeah. yeah! So Paige and Charlie have just gone on Everest. Um, I've taken Teddy to here, we're gonna go on here. And um, we done rider switch on Everest, so I'm gonna go on after they come off. But it said a 35 minute wait at the minute, so um, we'll see how long that is. You going fast? <laughs> so we will see you on this ride. I'll try and film a bit if I can. We're just on the ride. Teddy's moving it up and down. You gonna go high, Teddy? Mm -hmm. I see you keep going to the high. Go really high. This is Dino Land over here. So you've got a little kids area. This was only a five minute wait, so it wasn't too bad. Okay, so we just came off the, the ride. We took Teddy in the shop. Teddy, what'd you get? Yeah. You've got a big snake. Look here. Can you show the face? Look, look at his big face. Look, it's got a big tongue as well. Do you like that one? Yeah. Yeah? Getting to the age where you go in a shop, he doesn't want to leave until he gets something. So, um, 
it's costing us a bit of money to be honest but keeps him happy keeps him quiet so that helps us so yeah just gonna walk right round to uh, Everest try and see where Charlie is and see how much longer they're gonna be waiting Right, so we are just about to go on Everest. Paige and Charlie have been on there already. They got front row. Yeah. They're good. Yeah, really, yeah, really good. good. They were speaking to a family behind them who are from California. Uh, they were here for a week, and they're doing each park. Time. Yeah, it's their first time here, so I had a nice conversation with them. So me and Paige are going to go through the lightning lane now. Um, hopefully, it'll be a little bit quicker. I think Paige, Paige and Charlie waited about 20, 25 minutes, so it wasn't too bad. So. We will go on to the lightning lane and I'm going to try and video it, but I'm not sure if I can, but we'll give it a try. Most of that, I felt like my phone was gonna come out of my hand. So um, you got, what, you got what? Oh God! <laughs> you got, you got more than I could. Okay, so we're just making our way over to the Lion King show. We was gonna go and watch. We was gonna go on the safari ride, but it's a 115 minute wait at the minute. It is really busy here today. There he goes. Oh, he's all right there. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so if you've come to Animal Kingdom before, you know that the safari ride and the queue for it is just down, right down the bottom there. But the actual queue for it is all the way up here. It's going through Tusker House, uh, going out the other side of Tusker House, just for the standby queue. We would not be doing that queue, it's ridiculous. So a change of plan, we are not going to a Lion King show. Uh, the queue is ridiculous. Um, and there's no guarantee that you actually get in. Um, it could be fully booked and you'll be waiting in the line for half an hour. It's just mega busy here today. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna leave here. Uh, we're gonna make our way to the front of the park. It is only 25 to 11. Um, so we're gonna leave here and we're gonna go to the outlets. Um, we'll have some lunch there. Charlie and Paige are looking at some shops. Teddy's going to have a little nap. Then we may pop back to the hotel, maybe. Um, and then we're going to head for somewhere to eat earliest tonight because we want to go to Magic Kingdom. We don't feel too bad that, because we haven't paid for parking today, so we don't feel too bad leaving here early. But it's mega busy, really, really busy here today. So, um, yeah, we're going to give that, give Animal Kingdom a miss today. It might have just been the one off, um, but I do think. This next week is going to be busy. Um, it is spring break, I think, in Florida. Um, so it's going to get busier and busier. But it's always busy at Disney anyway, so but it's very busy here today. Okay, so we're just in the food court at the outlet. So this is what we got for lunch. Okay, so myself and Paige, Charlie might have some as well. We got um, Chinese, so we got orange chicken, I think it's bourbon chicken with rice. You can have it with noodles as well. That was $12.99. We also got a large drink, so in total it comes to about $17, I think it was. That's about 14 quid, I think it is, so quite expensive for lunch, really, for one person, I would say. Then little Teddy over here, he got a slice of pizza and some garlic bread. Didn't get a drink, he's got drinks already, and that came to $10.70, I think it was, which is about £9, I would say, so uh, he's enjoying it. So yeah, that was our lunch. Charlie's looking forward to shopping. Me too. She's getting ready for it. The money's bouncing out of her pocket, she can't wait to spend it. I've got that much money, I <laughs> She finds it somehow. Yeah. Apart from Body Works, I'm going to be waiting outside. Paige is 
looking at night today. She wants trainers and socks and whatever else she can get. Yeah. What was she looking at? You want to go Bath and Body Works as well, don't you? Underarm Kids because they said they have it this morning. Oh yeah, Under Armour Kids she wants to go to as well. So, so yeah, that's where we are at the moment. Teddy's yeah. enjoying his pizza. Teddy, Teddy, mm. do you like your pizza? Oh. <laughs> so I mean it all. Mm. <laughs> So yeah, we'll catch you up when we're spending money. Okay, so we just came out of Under Armour and it's ridiculous for us in there. Cheap. We got between eight and 10 items of clothing and it comes to $96, I think it was. But like t-shirts, I've got a few t-shirts in there that are $5. You can't even go in Primark at home and get a t-shirt like that, like that now. So um, we're just going back to Foot Locker because this one here wants to get some trainers and she doesn't shut up until she gets them. We had a look in Foot Locker, we went in Finish Line, we went in Adidas, we went in Nike, and there wasn't really much in those shops. But in Foot Locker, she found a pair that she liked. We're just gonna go and recheck them, and then she may be buying them. So. Okay, so myself and Paige have been in Foot Locker for about half an hour, 45 minutes, and we've come out with nothing. Because this little girl here is so bloody annoying. She wants something, she doesn't want it. She doesn't know she likes them. She doesn't know if they're too tight. She doesn't know if they're too big. She doesn't know. She just doesn't know. Then she's telling me she wants the ones in the UK. So we've just sat in there for half an hour, 45 minutes, wasting our time. Nightmare. She's worse than Charlie. And I thought Charlie was bad. So yeah, we're just heading over to Starbucks. I'm really thirsty, so I need a drink. I think Paige needs a drink as well. So, gosh, give me an headache today, I feel. Okay, so we've just come out of uh, Kate Spade. Charlie bought herself two bags, which we will show you a bit later. In total, they came to $247, I think it was. One of them was $398, and it was down to $93, so very big save. Spent a bit too much money today. I spent Charlie, the culprit, she's, as always, yep. Two bags, Paige has bought some stuff from Victoria's Secrets. We've got Bath and Body Works bags, I can see. I haven't actually looked in there to see what's in there. Yeah, I did buy quite a lot in Under Armour. Teddy's just sitting quietly. He's just on his phone. Not on his phone, but he's on Charlie's phone, watching YouTube. Um, I think what we do now is walk back to the other side of the outlets. We're gonna stop off, get a drink. Then we're gonna head to, probably head to the car, because it's half three. We did book our reservation at half four. So we're going to go and have that at the Outback Steakhouse. And then, um, yeah, that'll be it. And then from there, we're going to head to Magic Kingdom. Do you reckon we're going to be getting free parking? I don't think so. So we will see you at the Outback. Hi, guys. So we've just got to the Outback Steakhouse. Uh, we love the onion loaf in here, which we're going to be getting. Last time we came here, it absolutely chucked it down. It's quite nice in here. Um, if you haven't been i'd recommend it we'll show you what we get we're definitely getting the onion love so we will see you very soon with our food and let you know how it goes okay so we're just in the outback steakhouse so i've gone for the prime rib sandwich um, Paige has gone for so joey's soil one, which with, is medium well with fresh fruit, you don't have it? With fresh fruit. teddy has gone for the mac and roux, uh mac and cheese with fresh fruit and charlie has gone for aussie fries was it Char? Yeah, it's aussie fries it's just a it's a starter and and cheese and bacon so we'll, we'll show you it when it comes but um we've also ordered the onion blooming which is the sort of onion loaf and they also bring out fresh bread which you can just see here we've already tucked into it teddy's enjoying it <laughs> every time Every time I show you guys, every time I show you guys Teddy's eating, isn't it? He just doesn't stop eating. So we'll, uh, yeah, we'll show you our food once it arrives. Hi guys, so this is the onion loaf here. Look at the size of it. Absolutely lovely. You just pull pieces off like this and you just go dump. Okay, so these are our names. So Charlie has got, well, this is a starter. So this is like cheesy fries with bacon. Teddy has got macaroni cheese with fresh fruit. Paige has got sirloin steak with fresh fruit. And I have got a prime bridge sandwich. Hi guys, so we've just got in the car after going into the Outback Steakhouse. Food was really nice. Um, I had a prime rib sandwich and it had some cheese in it that was 
absolutely disgusting. Mm. Even Charlie didn't like it. Um, so I just had chips um, for dinner. I had a bit of Paige's steak that she left, um, and I had that onion blooming loaf thing anyway, yeah, right, for starters, yeah. which was lovely and loads anyway. So, but in total, the meal came to 50, 58 dollars. I was quite surprised with that price. We did have water. Teddy had an apple juice. Um, but yeah, apart from that, it was it was nice. Nice. Um, we are now heading from here to Magic Kingdom. It's half five at the moment. So we'll probably get to Magic Kingdom by half six. Hopefully, in the yeah, park by should, half six. It shouldn't be too busy going through security. Yeah, time, hopefully really. not, yeah. So um, that's going to be our next stop. And we will come back it to you look too bad, when we are there. It looks less busy. I'm looking on the app. And it looks less busy than Animal Kingdom. Yeah, Animal Kingdom is absolutely not a mess. So we'll see you at Magic Kingdom. Just like that, we're at Magic Kingdom. The only downside about coming this time of night is that we are right at the back. We're gonna have a very long walk later on this evening when we come out of Magic Kingdom. I think it starts at nine o'clock the show. So I don't expect us to get back to our hotel till probably half 10-ish, I would say. Okay, so we're just on the monorail now. Teddy, are you excited for the monorail? Yeah. Good afternoon, everybody. <laughs> Welcome aboard Monorail Black. Our next stop will be the Magic Kingdom. If you're sitting, please hold on to the silver handrails and never really against those automatic doors. If you're joining us for a happily ever after tonight, give me a big yee-haw! Yee-haw! Okay, so we're just in Magic Kingdom. The time is half six. Oh, dead on half six. There's so many people, yeah. They've all got their cameras set up. And, yeah, they're setting out for the night by the look of it. No. We're gonna try and get back there about eight o'clock and then um, hopefully get a good seat or a good position and then uh, yeah, watch the fireworks at nine or watch Happy, Happily Ever After. So um, yeah, we're gonna go on the Tomorrowland Speedway cars first and then we may do buzz as well. We'll see how that is because that's a constant moving line as well. So. Okay, so we're just in the queue for the Tomorrowland Speedways. It does say it's a 30 minute wait. Um, we got in it just after half six, so we'll see. The good thing with this one though, it does always move. It's, um, it's a constant flow, right? It's just car after car. So, um, and the good thing with this one is that we can all go on it. So we can all queue up together and we ain't got to wait off and find something else to do for someone while they wait and that sort of stuff. So um, yeah, we're gonna head on to this one first and then maybe do buzz after as well, but we'll see what the time is. Okay, so we're just nearly getting on the Speedway cars. It took us about 20 minutes in total, so not bad at all. Okay, we're just on the Tomorrowland Speedway. Teddy's driving. <laughs> Teddy driving, you turn in the wheel. All right, ready? We're gonna go fast. Let's go fast, ready? Go. Ah! Oh, we're gonna crash. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Is Tron over here. That is Teddy driving. Look at that bus. Oh, 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 Going fast. Are you turning the wheel? Teddy's going to be the next driver. He's going to be the next Hamilton. Oh, ready, ready, Teddy, Teddy, ready, go. Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Right, so we've just stopped at the sweet shop at the front of Magic Kingdom. Paige has got herself a very first toffee apple. I can't hold it anymore. I have to go out. <laughs> I'm not even just going to bite the toffee. Apple. It's huge. Teddy's got, Teddy's got um, a Rice crispy. Oh, he's got a big one, he has. Look at him, look, look at his teeth going in that, look. <laughs> oh, mummy's gonna have a try. Oh, she's gonna be the, f oh, there we go. It's quite soft, isn't it, I think? Yep, so the queues are getting bigger. The spaces are filling up. I think we're gonna go and sit down somewhere. Charlie doesn't want to, she's not happy. Okay, so we're just sitting down, waiting for the fireworks to start. It's half seven. We've got an hour and a half until it starts. But it's getting quite busy here. There's a lot of people sitting down already. There wasn't too much space left to sit. So uh, we 
we've managed to find a space here, which obviously when we when it starts, it'll be in the sky anyway, so we'll be able to see it. So, um, but yeah, looking forward to watching Happily Ever After. Okay, so Teddy's having a go at the apple now. Teddy, do you like the apple? Teddy, do you like the apple? <laughs> He's getting all the toffee around his face. Or well, the caramel, isn't it? Ain't got that is it caramel or toffee? Caramel. 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 Say cheese. Hello, Daddy. Okay, so we're still waiting. We've got 15 minutes until the start of the show. It's absolutely around. We can't move. People are pushing in. They've blocked off areas for walkways and people have just filled, filled them in. Um, yeah, that's what we do for Disney, yeah? And so our journey comes to an end. But yours continues on. Grab hold of your dreams and make them come true. For you are the key to unlocking your own magic. Now go, let your dreams guide you. Reach out and find your happily ever after. guys so we watched the happily ever after the first showing since its return and it was very good you enjoyed it yeah. yeah teddy, teddy look, you still did you like the fireworks yeah yeah he loved it and currently five to ten and yeah five to ten and we're just walking back to our car which is right at the back so um but the fireworks are really good um it's very busy very very busy there but it's expected um we was a bit worried that teddy wouldn't like them just because in May, he hated them, um, and he didn't like fireworks at all. Um, but we've shown him, we've had him watching them on TV for the last sort of couple of months. So he knows what was gonna happen, sort of thing. And when Mo Moana come on, he really enjoyed it, and then he sort of forgot about it, really. And he wants to watch them again. So we may go back again. Um, Paige really liked them as well, really enjoyed it. Yeah, we probably won't get back to the room until about half 10. So we're gonna finish the vlog here. I haven't had a chance to work out what we spent today. Um, it hasn't been too bad, but I'll update that in the morning. Um, but yeah, we're gonna... And tomorrow we'll show you what stuff we got. Oh yes, we will do. We'll show you that as well. Reminder. Yeah, reminder. See, that's what she's here for. Um, but yeah, we will... Hope you've enjoyed the vlog. If you have, please give us a big thumbs up. Um, if you've not yet subscribed, please push that subscribe button and also follow us on Instagram. Um, as I've said before, and as we said in our announcement video, we are coming back in August again, so we will be vlogging all that again. If there's anything you want to see that we're not showing, send us a message, let us know. We can try and accommodate those requests. But yeah, we're going to call it time there. Tomorrow we're going to go to Islands Adventure Universal. Um, not sure what one. We're going to go somewhere for breakfast. Um, but yeah, until then, we will see you tomorrow. Goodbye.